Welcome to Introduction to Python Programming course. This course is under uh, the VTO for engineering students of VTO uh, with the subject of BPLCK105 and 205B. This uh, course can be used by CS students, EC students, electronic students, electrical students as well as all the other, uh, other allied branches as well as non-engineering students who are interested in learning Python programming. So let's first learn the course objectives. The objective of the course is you should the student should be able to learn syntax and semantics of the Python. You should be able to uh, structure the data using list tuples. You should be able to write Python programming uh, using external files like Excel, PDF, Word, etc. You should be able to imp uh, write and develop programs using functions. You should be able to use built-in functions as well as write your own functions. And uh, we'll be implementing object-oriented programming concepts using Python. So this is the syllabus of the course. In the first module, we'll be discussing the Python basics. We'll be able to understand the different data types, integer, floating point, string data types. We'll also be writing our first program and understanding our first program in Python. We'll also discuss about flow control. And we'll be working on modules. We'll be working on different functions like the def, return values, and return statements. We'll also be doing some global statements. And finally, we'll be doing exceptions and write a small program called as guess the number. And in module 2, we'll be working on list, tuples, dictionaries. In module 3, we'll be working on strings. We'll be writing, working on uh, how we can read and write files from uh, external uh, to the program. In module 4, we'll be organizing the files. We'll be doing debugging. And in module 5, we'll be discussing about uh, the object-oriented concepts using Python. And the outcome of the course is, at the end of the course, the student should be able to demonstrate proficiency in handling loops and creating functions. The student should be able to create and manipulate list tuples and dictionaries. You should be able to write programs for string processing file organization. And finally, interpret the concepts of object-oriented programming using Python. So about this course, this program is designed to teach Python programming for engineering students of CSEC as well as other allied branches as per the syllabus of uh, academic year 2024 and 25. However, the course can also be used by other engineering students and non-engineering students who are interested in learning Python. And uh, you should be able to, uh, up after this course, you should be able to apply Python for implementing your projects and doing some projects using Python involving real world scenarios. Hence, by learning Python, you should be able to start your journey uh, for your chosen career such as data scientist, data engineer, AI, or other application developments in other branches. All the best. So this is the resources. Uh, you can uh, download the textbook, Automate the Boring Stuff with Python from this following link. You can also refer the other book, Think Python, from the available link here. So in the next session, we'll move on to module one. And what are the topics covered in module one is we'll be discussing the Python basics. We'll discuss about the different data types next. Then we'll write the first program and we'll understand the basics in the first program. And then let's understand flow control, Boolean comparison operators. We'll also discuss about functions, arguments, keywords, global statements, exception handling. And finally, we'll be writing a short program and for this module one you need to refer chapters one two and three from the first textbook that is automate the boring stuff with python thank you